Welcome everybody to the seasonal diet, eating what our ancestors ate when they ate it like we were evolved to do. Continuing this week, we are speaking about some of the earliest seasonal herbs. Right after the winter time, food supply would have been very low for our ancestors at this time of year. And most of the foods that grow, they would not be here still for another few months. So right now it would have been a lot of animal products and also the herbs. This is the very first edible things that start to grow coming out of the winter. Today we are speaking about parsley. It's a strong herb that can survive even some pretty cold winter temperatures and it's one of the first to get new growth as we get into the spring. It's native to the eastern Mediterranean region and it's been used for culinary, medicinal and even ceremonial purposes for thousands of years. Parsley was first cultivated in ancient Greece more than 2,000 years ago, but of course it would have been foraged wild much longer before that. It was considered to be a sacred plant even by the ancient Greeks, and it was used in wreaths to crown the victors of the Olympic Games, and it was used in decorating tombs of the dead. About 2,500 years ago, we find it used for medicinal purposes too, as a diuretic and as a treatment for kidney problems, uh, including urinary tract infections and even bad digestion and menstrual problems. These were all attested in the oldest Greek sources. Also, in ancient Greek poetry and plays, Parsley is often depicted as a symbol of victory, and it's sometimes associated with um, funeral customs and rituals. Romans also used parsley a little bit later on in history as a medicinal herb, um, mainly for its diuretic properties, makes you piss out all the bad stuff. Later on, during the Middle Ages, parsley was used for similar medicinal purposes all over Europe, and it was also believed to ward off evil spirits. So although it's native and we have most records of it in the Mediterranean region, it could have easily been grown in the colder northerly regions of Europe or of course traded to. Parsley was introduced later on in history to North America in the 17th century and it quickly became popular in gardens and cooking there as well. Today, parsley is widely cultivated and used in many different uh, cuisines all around the world and it is actually believed to have some of the health benefits as was uh, thought 2000 years ago it's a good source of vitamins a c and k and minerals like iron and calcium and even though ancient uses of it uh, some of them haven't been confirmed by modern science Parsley today is generally believed to also help with giant digestive issues, high blood pressure even, and arthritis also. So that's about it. Right about now is a great time of year to add some fresh parsley to your diet, and this can last all the way until the early summer. But as always, herbs are something that can be eaten year round because when they are dried and preserved, they have a very long shelf life and of course can be added to lots of things whole year round. So let us know, do you guys like parsley? Do you like to put it in any specific things? Let us know below in the comments.